Whether it's volunteering for candidates or news networks, submitting questions and attending the debate itself, or covering it for the university paper, students at St. Anselm College found that hosting a political debate gave them access to a wide range of opportunities that allowed them to get personally involved. Um, I am here with the St. Anselm Crier. I'm the news editor. So um, Father Jerome, who is our advisor, is kind of getting me to uh, see the press reaction to all that's going on. So I feel like a lot of the students have uh, a big presence and I feel like they're getting more and more interested in being involved in politics and asking questions of like climate change and um, student debt, a lot of student debt questions. So I think it's really important for us to show our voices and stay heard. And even if they weren't directly involved in the debate, everyone on campus got to experience the feeling of hosting an event seen across the country. So it's really great to see our tiny little campus transformed into something this huge. The debate is happening in our ice arena, and I love to ice skate, so I'm always like there skating, and now it's crazy to think about, well, all these candidates are going to be the same place I love to skate so much. But the student experience at St. Anselm College is particularly different. Because New Hampshire hosts the first in the nation primary, even those students not participating in the debate are offered a lot of opportunities to interact with candidates. We, as a student body, get to experience this whole thing, which is really, really cool. Um, and we get to participate in the sense, even if you're not a politics major, you get to experience and be interviewed. And on Tuesday, St. Anselm students, along with the rest of the state, will get to vote in the country's first Democratic and Republican primary of the 2020 campaign. Isha Sarai, VOA News, Manchester, New Hampshire.